You are graduating today from a world-class university. We are celebrating years of hard work and hard choices, long nights that often became early mornings. You went to Michigan Tech, and guess what? It is harder up here. And that is a calling card. That is a point of pride. Michigan Tech is not on the way to anywhere. No one ever got here by accident, and I'm willing to bet even your friends from high school still really don't know where you go to school. Living here is not easy either. You live on the snowiest campus in America. But you've not just survived here, you've thrived here. You've seen the northern lights from your campus. Some of you wear ski goggles to class and cargo shorts <laughs> at the same time. <laughs> I've seen this. I've never seen any students who embrace the outdoors more than you do. It is because your school is hard. It's because the winters here are so tough that you've made friendships that will last forever. One of the graduates today told me, up here, we stick together. The strength of the bonds you forged will last a lifetime. Who else could understand your experience? Years from now, when people talk about your lives, they will not talk about how rich or famous you became. They will talk about only two things, the values you stood for and the people you helped. That's it. That's the whole show. You had strong values before you came here, or you wouldn't have come here. Your generation especially is motivated less by pay and power and prestige and more by a challenge, a mission, and a deep sense of belonging. No one in America is better prepared to make a big difference than you are today. So don't tell me that the future has already been written. I know that it hasn't been because you are the ones who are going to write it. You are the individuals. The moments are in front of you. Today we are not releasing a pack of domesticated puppies out into the wild. We are unleashing full-grown huskies. And you are ready to run.